Tata. No cards. Blake. Red. <laughs> Who here has been told to work in a team before? Whether it be sports, school, or work, I'm assuming everybody has been forced to work in a group at some point. But with a study from 2018 saying that only 38% of kids ages 6 through 12 are put into team sports by Michael Bradley, the normality of being on teams may be going away for children. Sports are an easy way to get kids involved in the world around them and their community and just an easy way to get them active. Um, sports are more than just kicking a ball into a goal or hitting a ball and running the bases. It's about getting active and making friendships. Um, playing sports for all my life, I've been able to reap plenty of benefits from it. Um, kids should be putting sports for things like learning how to work in a team, um, influencing their personality, and even getting a job later in life when they're done. Um, team sports obviously build how well your t kid is going to work in a team in a group scenario. Um, from Will Hinch, there's no I in team. It's an age-old motto that's both grammatically correct and relevant in team situations in sports and elsewhere. When coaches send a group of players out onto the pitch, they're sending out a team, not a group of individuals. Um, so sports force athletes to have good communication with one another. Um, no communication in a team leads to struggles for the team, but then if they work together and have good friendship or good communication, they're going to end up making friends on the team and creating lifelong friendships. Um, good communication also leads to accountability between teammates. Uh, things like if you mess up or you forget a play, then your teammates are going to be able to tell you that and you're going to learn. Um, and with that accountability comes high self standards. So you're going to want to do good for your team. And if you fail, they're going to be there to help you through it. And if you do good, they're going to tell you and you're going to keep raising those standards for yourself, making yourself a better person. Um, teamwork, once again, breeds success. And along with the success comes confidence. Um, a good team works like a well oiled machine and they're going to be able to breed success and have success come their way. Um, Will Hinge, once again, with the success of a team comes confidence to each of the players. This can be a positive or negative line for children. Um, this leads into my next point of uh, building your child's personality and whether it's through coaching or just your, how the players act. Um, kids are gonna make lifelong friendships on a team. And then a quote, from I9 Sports says, the players on a team spend hours practicing or playing and their teammates are the only ones who get to share that experience with them. They work and play hard together, get sweaty and dirty, and compete for positions and playing time and bond over what the coach is teaching them. A coach is gonna shape your child's personality, whether it's good or bad, and you're gonna have to learn. It's gonna take trial and error to find that good coach. Um, but a good coach is going to instill good values and teamwork and especially how to win into your child. Um, and finally, the third way your child's personality is going to grow is through logical and strategic thinking. Um, just on the field, they're going to have to learn the next play, what the best thing to do is. And, um, yeah. Finally, getting a job after after they're done with sports, um, just adults who are put in sports as a kid have a better ability to get a job when they're older. Um, playing through college is going to set you out and make you look better in a job. Sarah Rondo says that companies hire ex-athletes because they know their ability to work on the team. Being in team sports lead to skills that cannot be gained by others that sit on the couch and don't do anything. Um, if you quit early though, you're still going to reap the benefits of it. You're not that base of being in sports and your personality has already been built when you're put in sports.
Finally, we discussed how team sports can help teamwork, develop your child's personality and make them who they are, and finally, even after they're done playing sports, getting a job later in life. Um, I just want to leave you with by asking you to put your kid in team sports and I can almost guarantee success throughout their life.